Okay, um, welcome. Here I have three plus two a divided by two equals negative one. I wanna get this problem in, out, and done very quick for you. So remember, when using inverse operations, um, if I have fractions, just get rid of fractions, okay? Um, I'm not gonna teach us these inverse operations um, way. I don't like fractions. So whenever I see a fraction, I think of how can I get rid of the fraction? Remember, a fraction is a division problem, right? I have this numerator, and it's being divided by 2. So to undo dividing by 2, I need to multiply by 2. So I'm going to multiply the 2 times that whole numerator. Then I need to make sure I multiply on the right side as well. Well, if you multiply something by 2 and then divide something by 2, they're what we like to say cancel out, but not really. They actually divide to 1. And 1 times this numerator is just going to be that numerator. Negative 1 times 2 is negative 2. Now I have a lovely two-step equation that I can solve. So remember, I have 3 um, plus 2a. Since that's a positive 3, I'm adding the 3 to my 2a because this is a positive 3. So now, to undo adding 3, I'm going to subtract a 3. So I subtract a 3. That goes to 0. So I get 2a plus 0, just be 2a, equals negative 2 um, minus 3, which would be a negative 5. Now, to undo multiplication of 2, I need to divide by 2. Therefore, I get a equals a negative 5 halves, or if your teacher is asking for it, you can write it in fraction form as a negative, I'm sorry, not fraction form, decimal form, as a negative 2.5. So hopefully I did that quick enough for you, and I hope you understand. Thanks.